Yo, what is up, bros? I'm back with the Kamikaze round number 102. Look at this huge opening now. We are about to put the Soviet Union out for good. And of course, when we reach the Swiss, we will be declaring war on the said Swiss. So we're just kind of holding out here now, and I think it's more than obvious that the U.S. has started spamming generals. This is more what it looked like when we came in as Germany. Bros, I think pretty soon we can launch an invasion of the U.K. Real quick though, before we get started, you know what I gotta do. Boom, a shout out to the member bros, especially those tier 3 field marshals, Golden Boy 6198. And why am I doing this along with all you other colonels? And privates holding it down as member bros. A big shout out and a thank you. With that, let's go. You know, we don't even really have room for these anyways in mainland Europe. So we might as well start heading towards the UK with this group. I think that's what we'll do. Crush the Navy. Start getting bros out to sea. Cross the defenses, get them out of the way. Nice. We barely held Berlin, but we did in fact hold it. It was a close call. Uh, you know what? We need to take some units out here so we can even get moved around. There we go. Yeah, see, we, we wouldn't have room for all these guys where we're going anyways. So I guess it is to the UK, which is not very well guarded. Shouldn't be that much trouble getting it open. Damn. Stuff's falling quick now. So this will probably be the last round that they are in any position to be able to get Berlin back. This is like, this is, we're gonna get them far, far enough back that they're not gonna have a chance. We'll even put a general on that just to make sure we hold it. Look at this. Damn. Oh, do we got one here? Oh, yeah, we've got a major general here. Is it the same bro on this? It is. Shit. All right, well, that's going to slow us down. Damn, he hits hard, too. Yeah, that's gonna, um, that's definitely gonna slow us down in the south. Two generals with over 2k health. Whoa. What is this? Ah, uh, yeah, we can take him out, no problem. I'm gonna move quite a few of these up now. They were gonna be more Balkans oriented. We got, we got more issues up here. More pressing issues. 2,000 health generals, we gotta... We gotta demolish before we can move on. Well, shit, I mean... Balkans are... Pretty much already cleared. There ain't much left. We did that quick. Did we have... I can't remember, did we have Sicily cleared when we ended? I kind of feel like we did. I kind of feel like we're going back over Sicily again. All right, so again, air units clearing out this crap. And we did hold pretty well here. But we do need to get more of these guys across. Oh, 
shit, I wanted to get that open. Yeah, see, that's a that's a decent amount right there. Okay, we got the meat shield back up on the front. We got all our Turkish bros moved in. We got our carry group doing work in southern Italy and taking out some ships here. We now have a pretty decent foothold in southern Spain with our good units coming across and the meat shield is back up along the coast in Africa. Back to Central America. I'm going to keep building super artillery here to help take out all these landing craft. It's a little bit more than what our carrier group can handle because they are spamming pretty hard here. Let me go ahead and drop a couple. Unlike the uh, northern Mexico front, these actually are there the next round. You know what I mean? They, they don't get, uh, you, know, you don't build three, come back, and they're all gone. Which is what's been going on here. Which is why progress has been so miserably slow here. We haven't got anything done. This whole aircraft carrier group maybe got one city open, maybe. Because all the cities have generals on it and their health is enormous, so don't be expecting much for, out of that. Look at our German bro. Pretty much leading the vanguard in here. There's the vanguard unit and then he is leading the vanguard. He's the vanguard of the vanguard. See, if we could just have a setup like we do here in the south, we'd probably already have met up with our bros. Yeah, but th there was nowhere near that many generals when we first got here. There was, there wasn't, any, there was barely any generals here. I remember talking about like, damn, there's... Not too many generals through here. Shouldn't take us too long. And then the spam came. The general spam came of the same general over and over again. Damn, they're even sneaking generals past our front here. The hell's that about? Damn, and that general's pretty strong. <sighs> yeah, we, we need we need more down here, I think. And definitely need more over here. More super artillery. Round 103. What the hell happened here? Let's track it back, see what happened. This happened. They took that and was able to go all the way through here. Uh, we should be able to take all that back pretty easy, I think. Yeah, that ain't gonna be a problem. We'll take everything back. Nice try, guys. What else happened? Look at this. It's just a... Bros. It's very, very close to an absolute steamroll through there. Okay, so we do got um, South America. Look, we're about... Hold on. Actually, let's do this right now. This will be the first city taken in South America if we can open it up. Got it. There you go. Boom. Uh, yep, it's gone again. I'm just going to stop building one there. That's a waste of money. It's an absolute waste of money. Everything held up here decently. All right, UK invasion. Let's hop up here real quick. Help these bros out. Let's start trying to get all our super artillery out to sea. Get a get a decent um, infantry meat shield in front of them. Look at, all, look at all this damage we could be doing. Remember the massive um, two-pronged pincer we were doing? 
There's just nothing. I had feared that. It, it, it happens a lot. You know, you have this big plan out of encirclement. And by the time you get the shit encircled, there's like nothing left. There's nothing left to encircle. That's exactly what happened here. So once we get these generals out... That one's pretty low. I think that's what is that one of the good ones? No, that's Fatutin chilling out. Fatutin just hanging out on the front, you know, seeing what's going on, making some strategic calls. Hoping he doesn't end up in the gulag because they are hemorrhaging territory. This down here was a lot easier than I had expected it to be. They got steamrolled. We need Sevastopol. Nice. Yeah, they thought... They thought... They probably thought they had the breakout. They're like, it's done. We got it. We got it, boys. We got them. And then lose all the territory in one round. Yeah, now we got all this landing. The Turkish bro is coming through. Turkish production. That's a pretty good round for the carry group. They got all the generals down. Uh, now it's just crapper ships. We'll be able to take those out easy. Just start making more room for these bros to land. I did not mean to fire where I just fired. That was ac accidental fire. We're actually starting to lose ground here. What the hell is going on? Like, I'm taking back territory we already had that we shouldn't have lost because the units we're going up against are pretty much crap. And we even lost that. So I think, again, we're just going to target everything trying to land with our carrier group, especially the generals. Well, we got this whole area cleared out. Next round, maybe this area or this area. I don't really even know what to do. We actually need more aircraft carriers down here. And as far as production of these, I think I'm going to go ahead. Upgrade this. Because putting them down here just isn't working. They're getting instantly. I mean, that's a waste of 90 each round. Just putting one right there. With the help of our carrier group down here, we were able to get a pretty good bulge going into Texas. And our two fronts are about to link up. But I got so many units in the way, I can't even get anybody down there. Um, maybe we can pull a couple out. I would really like to get that city. That'd make it. That'd make the two fronts look a lot better. Yeah, we can't even get down there. That sucks. Whose idea was it to just cram infantry in there? Well, uh, I mean... At least we're still demolishing generals left and right. Alright, that's the last of the generals they tried to sneak in behind our lines. I've been, I don't know what's been happening, but I'm, I'm getting low on cash every time I get to this point. I've got 400 left. I've been skipping on the super artillery production last few rounds out here. I should probably do what I did in Germany and go... 
just one thin meat shield. Not too deep, not three deep, so that I can actually get my good equipment on the front to do damage. We're suffering from too much technologies right now. So the carrier group was able to get that open. I didn't put down hardly any more infantry. That was way too thick. Our super artillery couldn't even get to the front. Round 104. I need to uh, put some, move some equipment into that center part right there. You know what it is though? It's those generals with the high health. All right, bros, we're out. The good units coming in. You know what I think I'll do? I think I'll take some of these and kind of whip around here to attack these from the back. We got to get this meat shield formed up to protect our good equipment. There we go. Nice. Let's use some precision here. We're going to get some precision in on here. There's the bad spot that looks really thin. Oh, you know what? They took that. That's where they got that shit from. They took that airfield right there. That's how they were able to get through here. Is this one of those generals? What the hell? We just ran headlong into some generals that just won't go down. They saved like their best equipment for this, uh, as soon as we got to Berlin. Okay, so where's that other general? Oh, he's all the way down here. All right, okay. Let's, so let's focus on taking these two out because they're costing us territory. The two 2,000 health generals. Can we just focus fire on these guys for a round? Thank you. One's down. And the other one is right there. Which I don't even think I want to engage. Because he still has a lot of health left. Okay, that's helping. Damn, 400! Massive hit! Where's those hits been at? Alright, that's looking a lot better than it did. I had to use some of our aircraft carriers to take back a couple of these docks. The Soviets took because I don't want them spamming shit again. I'm done with that spam. I'm ready for it to be over. Nice pickup. Should we try to open Rome? Let's see how much damage we can do to it. Uh, that's probably a waste of time. Oh my god, we... Nice hit, bro. I was prepared to move a bunch of these up there to try to take Madrid. Bro opened it up with a one-shot. Damn, as soon as we were able to start getting these landed. I mean, it was over. That's all we needed was to get these in position. Back in Mexico, where, I mean, it seems just like all of a sudden, we have a crap load of super artillery. We can stop being so dependent on the uh, aircraft carriers. It's a good feeling to be independent. I'm continuing a healthy dose of super artillery production. Who would have thought that we would have more down there than we do in the on the main front here? Like, how the hell did that happen? I'll tell you how it happened. Because a bro we put down here kept getting whacked. All right, two more super artillery down. I'm looking for a city that we could possibly take that would inch us closer to this because we're about to take that one. Maybe this one right here? 
And we can reach it. Let's see how much damage it does. Yeah, let's go for that one. So that looks a lot better now. We grabbed that city, took out a few crapper units. And now to make it look its best, we need to take this city. I don't know how strong that general is going to be on there. Yeah, he's going to take some... He's going to take some punishment. Got him. Oh, look at that. Three hexes away from linking up with our bros. That will be huge. That will be absolutely massive. Damn, we need to get bro. Is this still this is Rommel, right? Yeah, we need to get Rommel some hills. Somebody needs to get on that. Rommel has been in this too long to go down now. Yeah, man, we got we grabbed that as well. See, the front got thinner on Meat Shield, and we're able to actually get most of these bros attacking. Which is exactly what we needed. We are kind of, uh, even though we had overwhelming super artillery, we couldn't get moved. All right, you know what? We need this city right there. That would... You know what? They're... I think we've had these cities a couple different times. They're kind of pushing us back here. Yeah, I think we've had all these cities a couple different times. I think we're going to be able to grab this with just crapper units. Crapper units got the finishing move. I, that makes it look a lot better. All right, bros, that's what it's looking like. We are that close to splitting the U.S. in half. All right, bros, if you are enjoying this content, you know what to do. Slap the like, subscribe with the notification bell, and I will see you back here for our next upload. Peace, Bruminati out.